What is up, reviewees? Coming at you live from the State Fair, holding Braylon hostage. We got Willie B in the background. <laughs> State Fair vibes. We didn't even get in the front gate. And look what this is review board found. Made us buy a chicken leg. A cool microphone. This guy on the street here. Stolen. Kidnapped. Turkey leg. Look at the size of this turkey leg. We're here to review stuff. Pickle pizza. Uh, hot dog on garlic a donut, buttered steak garlic on a butter steak. steak on a stick, cinnamon butter cookie funnel dough. cakes, we don't know, and whatever Apparently Braylon smoked wants. chicken legs. Welcome to the Review Board! Sit right down and just enjoy, eat it on steak before you go out and buy. These are the guys. The Review Board! Welcome to the Review Board! Sit right down and just enjoy. Jake, Joe, Dee, Puff, and the boys are on the review board. Welcome to the review board. Yeah. So we bought the turkey leg, as you saw in our intro video. Mrs. Review Board was hungry. She was trying to eat a granola bar before while we were in the parking lot. Still, Pretty good nineteen smoke bucks. Flavor. Smoked turkey leg. Mrs. Review Board said it had. Not hammy. a fan of the skin. It's not crispy skin. No? I'll you try like the skin? Can you try it? Does kind of have a ham flavor ish, but that's that smoke. High in protein. I mean, you got to try it. I mean, just. Is it worth $19? Yeah. I mean, yeah. We're going to consume. Especially because, like, you could share this with four people. For sure. You know, so yeah. Oh, that's hot on the inside. Yeah, give it a try. 7.5. Makes a good microphone. Yeah, makes a fun microphone. Hey, sir. How's it going? We're with the review board on the street. You want to talk into my turkey leg? <laughs> All right. Garlic buttered steak on a stick. At the same place that we're going to buy the... Pretty good. Pretty good. Classic. Don't right. get the garlic, though. Don't get the garlic. You just get regular steak on the stick. I don't know why you would immediately go like Because I like things spicy. Do you? Alright. We got dill pickle pizza here. It's a lot, a lot of cheese. I put some red pepper flakes on it. Thick pick, pick, pickle slices. Bryn would love this. 35 bucks for a whole pizza or $8 for a slice. So we went for the whole pizza. I don't know if I'm sold on it. It's got like a white mozzarella sauce. Yeah, the, yeah, I'm not sure about the sauce. Oh, we'll clean that up. Pretty good. It definitely Listen. gives you the pickle flavor. Dill pickle flavor. Mm -hmm. You're at the fair. You're going to get something on a stick. It's just the thing you're going to do. This was pizza on a stick. That was Ooh. much better. Oh, good, good cheese bowl. McCann, nice. Crust is actually pretty good on this pizza. I, I want my red sauce on my pizza. Sorry. Red sauce? Mm. Yep, but I do love my pickles. Okay, so this is, a, this is good. Pizza on step. Pizza bites. On the stick. That. 11. Yep, no, pizza on stick. We got them to double cut this, so smaller slices. Not bad, so though. So what's the score on a pizza? Um, Solid six. I was going to go seven. The pizza on a stick is an eight, though. Let's go. This was fun though. Rookie score. You need mustard, Johnny? Yeah, everywhere is it up. Yeah, what do you think? How is it? A thumbs up one? It looks like it gets big and then small at the uh, bottom there. Definitely tapers. Hot dog all the way up there at the bottom? It, now, would you rate it? Metaphorically, if you had to rate something, what would you give that one? It's like a one? Is that like a three? Yeah. Would you give that like a four? We're eating corn dogs here at the State Fair. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. They're rude around here. Hopefully we found real fries this time. Last year's fiasco fries. 
Oh, these are, these are much better. Way more authentic. 12 bucks for the bucket, and it's good all day, all week. All week, that's a hot tip right there. To $8. refill for eight bucks. Oh yeah. Oh, and I got the vinegar to spray on it right there. Yeah, that's how you know it's real, real fair fries. Yep. There's the vinegar gun. Love it. <laughs> Definitely much better than last year. Thank you. A soft crunch to it. Soft crunch, but there is a crunch. I like it. All right, funnel cake time. We've got a pumpkin battered funnel cake with pumpkin spice cream cheese topping. Are they overdoing the pumpkin spice? Maybe a little bit, but it is actually middle October in South Carolina. And we are white girls, so. So, we like it. I'm not a pumpkin fan. I am an apple girl all the way. That looks pretty darn good. Mm. Let's jump in on this. Okay. So they didn't overdo the pumpkin. Um, no, the apple one is so good. So definitely have to get the funnel the with the apple. actually really good. I think it would have been a little better if the apples were a little warm or kind of cold. Are they? Oh, yeah, uh -huh. when it's hot apple. Oh. Yeah, 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 I agree with you on that one. Warm up the apple. I gotta give that one a. It's a good, good base on the funnel cake. It's thick. I'm giving it an eight. It's good, but actually, I'm going with the pumpkin spice. Do me too. The pumpkin spice is because they didn't overdo the pumpkin spice. Oh, Sean, mm -hmm. just bite into it right now and tell us what that is. It's the uh, s'more, uh, fried s'more, fried oh. s'more, fried s'more. But you haven't had it yet. How could you have more fried? <laughs> <laughs> You concur? Because you can talk with your mouth full of the review board. <laughs> ten bucks for That's the s'more. That might be the ten. Is it even tall? And, and these were yeah. hot, fresh out the fryer. Mm, and the funnel it. cakes were twelve. You'd go with the s'more. I like the apple. Yeah. But the pumpkin spice is nice. It's not overdone, so I like that. Mm -hmm. The apples they definitely needed to warm up. They warm it up, and it would have elevated it. Let's go. Look at the graham cracker with the graham marshmallow in between. Chocolate sauce. That is an awesome cross section. Oh yeah, it's better than last year's chicken on a stick inside the stadium. Good call, Mrs. Review Board. Buying it before we go to the game this year. I think it's cheaper. Yeah, it's cheaper. <laughs> How much was it? Well, it was nine dollars for a piece of chicken. I think it was seven last year, but uh, it's a whole piece. That's pretty good. Let's go. game and then came back and they still refilled them and they let us bring it back in so they were they're consistent, people that they're consistent. yeah <clears throat> eight bucks to refill Not oh bad. and still phenomenal nice and warm consistency do they kind of remind you of like almost a mcdonald's track well it's it's the is it the oil 
I don't, it's the, it's whatever the texture is to it, the soft crunch. Bray, what do you think? It is it's nice, definitely worth it if you've got a group yeah. I mean, if you're and you're going to come to the fair. Like South Carolina State fair easy. Check it out. Fries. I bet this goes to other state fairs. Yeah, definitely yeah. worth the refill. We got a Deanna's Steak Sunday. But I went shrimp and grits. You're going to find fries in the bottom. Shrimp and grits. We're at South Carolina State Fair. I mean, how are you not going to get that? Smells actually really good for what it is. Now, I haven't been eating shrimp at sketchy locations, but I've taken one out. Shrimp and grits. That's the fair. Parade shrimp. You could use my fork. Look. Now you got some kick to it. God. They did not skimp on the grill seasoning. There's some heavy, but shrimp was a little chewy there. Like they overcooked it. Instead of cooking it three minutes, they cooked it about five. The grits weren't the best, but very good. It's but the, the flavor is amazing. Yeah, the flavor is good. This gives you a different option if you want some seafood at the fair. What's this, Petey? <laughs> oh, steak. steak the steak Sunday. Sunday. You we don't added, need ice cream anymore. We added mushrooms. The mushroom is cold. We'll see. Warm up the mushrooms, guys. This was good. 15 bucks for this? Oh, man. Oh, it's got fries in it. Wow. Steak. You could do surf and turf for 19. Put some shrimp on there. Cheese. That's a fun Sunday. Way better than the chocolate kind, I think. A little better than the shrimp and grits. A little better. 6.8. Let's go. Hi, donut burger. So this is the one we reviewed last year. Two Krispy Kreme donuts. Sean left the garden on his. I don't like garden. Okay, initial bite. I didn't taste the meat at all. And then, like, afterwards, I started tasting the meat. I wouldn't have thought it was a good combination, but I absolutely love Krispy Kreme donuts. So, yes, love it. Try a little, a little ketchup with it. Oh, yeah, you are a huge Krispy Kreme donut fan. Mm -hmm. I'm actually going by Krispy Kreme on our way home to pick up donuts. Uh, oh, so the light's on. Alright. Alright, what do you score that? I mean, I love my Krispy Kreme donuts. I, I like a burger pizza. It's um, fine. I think it's a little too sweet for a burger. Um, maybe a seven. Respectable. <laughs> Doesn't mean I'll stop eating it though. <laughs> I like it. I'd give it a seven and a half. I'd get another one next year. Alright. That's a review. Alright guys. This is review board for our health fans. A roasted sweet potato in the foil, dump it out at the parade. At the parade. That's what Petey's been calling it. So I mean just straight up sweet potato. Not too good. So, it was supposed to be one big one, but they gave us two small ones, which worked. So, if you wanted a little brown sugar, not horseradish, brown sugar for your sweet pan. But honestly, the sweet potato itself is super good. Seems right? Definitely good. That's an eight all day. Give you healthy options, seven bucks. Huh? came back with a bag of chips and salsa stuffed to the brim seven bucks a couple street tacos and a big thing of horchata how much was this i don't know this is a review like board that spends it but like I, she said this horchata a 10 out of 10. very good if you like horchata made from rice 
Let's give it. Okay, big nice chip. Nice. Little fruit taco after. Oh yeah. Those are flavorful. Nice. Check it out. Upon first looks, it made you say, "Holy." Now I'm looking at it, it's it's a top cut bun, but, but it's, it's a, a donut. donut. They put bacon on it, I was not ready for that. And instead of mustard, they didn't even I'm not even gonna put mustard on it. Normally I put mustard on everything. Now let's spin around like this so we get some fun stuff behind us. We got it out. Oh. It's definitely not a Krispy Kreme that they now squeeze together. This is a homemade donut. That's a homemade donut. That's Man. fun. This was my favorite thing. The bun is not, it's not a not sweet a donut. Sweet it's more like a bun. Ma'am. I gave that fun. one a 10. Now listen, as we roll out, this is the last thing we got after we've eaten everything else today. So. Might have to stop by and get a couple of tums. Not something you would eat every day. Once well, a year no, when you, you come to the fair, state yeah. fair. Um, definitely had fun with all the guests. We've uh, had pop in to do some reviews with us, which also helped us eating a lot of that stuff we saw. So great job, guys. Gamecocks covered the spread. Lost by two, but a heck of a. I mean, they combined 80 points. It was a heck of a fun game. Got our money worth on that. Oh, yeah. Fun time. Check out the fair. Let us know what your favorite thing was to watch us eat. Thanks for subscribing. Please subscribe, like, and if no one's told you today, you are a 10 out of 10. Let's go.